don't care what you did to me huh. It doesn't take away my pain no. huh. oh, uh. It makes me weaker to let another girl move me mm. You know what I'm saying? Com like Competition I like <laughs> I'm gonna give I'm gonna give up what I have, like ring the alarm, Beyonce. <laughs> have y'all heard I'll that? <laughs> Girl. Girls, what? Love yourself. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. <laughs> okay, I could have had triplets. I don't care. And nobody will squeeze me into thinking that that behavior is okay. Girls right now, their man ain't even ain't got a job jobless at air crying over some whatless man and you're still there and he still has the audacity the temerity to cheat girl nobody can love you the way you love yourself i swear to god you will not let yourself down hi guys and welcome back to my channel there's a lot of different things that i want to be talking about today so hopefully i can squeeze them in um i've been all right you know i've been suffering from migraines for a couple of days now and it's affected this eye i actually can't see as far away as my camera is quite far away I don't actually know what the hell i'm doing so we're just gonna blag it <laughs> also like a couple of snips of like certain podcasts i've seen online also reviewing asteria hair today oh my god i thought i broke my nail i was like what the hell not the nail but it's not thank jesus jesus loves me <laughs> um, I think the first thing I'm going to do is review this wig from Asteria. Ast is it Asteria or Asteria? Y'all get, y'all need to teach me. I don't know. Now when I put on this wig just now, I'm like, the coilo is not bad at all. Coilo is just blending with my coilo. Oh, let me, let me eye the breast. You can't see the breast. It's not for your eye. But I do feel like it's giving like, it's giving coal. We'll stick it down and go from there. Um, but it's definitely giving side part you want to see me cute today because i'm gonna tear you down to the floor so i'm gonna sorry my fan is on because it is extremely hot in this house um so i'm gonna just use my ultra hold glue um got to be it's all the same you know what i mean you know what i mean i know you guys want to just get in the video but this wig is definitely lit so just sit back relax you know what I mean? Watch me, watch me slay. You get me? You know what I mean? Watch me do what I do best. this in this lit this little clip that i watched yeah i feel like it like, um you know I, I would probably send my man to hell for not calling me or texting me for a whole day before i sent him to hell for catching him having a, a drink or you know at a hotel with another with a with a hug. having sex not just yeah okay, yeah <laughs> earlier about how women's perceptions about cheating is like completely different and 
I find it so scary. I find it so sad that women literally will take BS because, you know, they feel like another woman is taking their place. So they don't want to leave. I understand. I don't even get that. You see me, I will welcome you with open hands. Take the idiot away from me. Take that idiot away from me. Don't near me. Don't near me. When will women start to find this odd? I don't understand. So, your logic is that because this man has been cheating, yeah, and the girl, she might be feeling like, feeling too cool. Like, I stole your man. Yeah, we can do by da, 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 da. So now, you two, you wear boxing glove. You're ready to fight for that stupid idiot. I'm not understanding. Baby, make it make sense because I'm very flabbergasted. Women gotta start loving themselves more. You lot gotta love yourself more. When my own happened, I said to God, I said to God in heaven, that like, I know this is the end result. I know I'm not going back. I know. And that's what really made me sad because I really had to draw a line under it. Like, okay, this is... I understand it will take a while for that to sink in, to set in. It will take a while for you to be like, oh, you know, this person is no longer going to be in my life. Especially if you was like me and you've been together for a long time, you know, you're living together, you know, or you have like me, you have baby. I don't care. Okay. I could have had triplets. I don't care. And nobody will squeeze me into thinking that that behavior is okay. I know there's a lot of outside noise. Oh, you know, we've been together a long time. You know, you're my baby for such a long time. We spend so much time together. We have children together. Listen, you should not give a shit. Give a damn. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. <laughs> like, you pick yourself up and you find somewhere else to go. And the world is so big. It's so large. It's so sexy. You know, you might not find someone straight away. You don't have to. You know, a couple of years might pass. But I'm telling you, there is nothing like, there is nothing sweeter than what? Peace of mind. I go to sleep. I go to sleep. Other woman might feel like she's really braggadoing. Like, you're, the, you're even more dumb than him. It's going to happen to you very, very soon. You know, if it's not happened already. Just be with someone, you know, based off of the fact that you think someone else is coming to take your seat. Let them take the seats. Take the seats. Go and sit down there. I don't want to be there anymore anyway. So enjoy the seats. Sit comfortably. I'm telling you. You see, there's God in heaven, yeah? God will fight your battle. And when I tell you, karma is the biggest bitch. I'm not about to try and rekindle. Rekindle what? You have spoiled the trust. The trust is damaged. So what am I going to do? What am I doing here? What am I doing with you? You are a waste person now. You are a complete waste. And you look diseased to me now. You're a disease. I'm going to violate you. Carry your bag and go. Everybody else knows outside apart from me. Are you mad? So my man is going to be outside. He's going to be cheating on me. And I have no idea. Eh? Sorry? And I'm claiming you. Am I, am I, <laughs> am I mad? Anybody can insult me if they want to insult me. Oh, she's a single mom. She's a blah, 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 blah. I would rather be a single mom for the rest of my life. For the rest of my life than have a man violate me. God forbid I must be mad. That's the day that you see me jump into lagoon. When there's people out there that they adore me. When there's men out there, they love me. They want to cuddle me. They want to kiss me. They want to hold me. Like, I would rather be out here being a single mom and holding tight. <laughs> hold tight your single mom flex than for me to be sitting down like a like a like a cabbage so you want to who do you think you are you're going to be doing boxing you want to be boxing every stranger that he decides to have sex with if you want to be chloe kardashian that's your business that's your prerogative he's still you know a ball player do you people are on how many hundreds of figures okay maybe that's why you're staying there no problem but you got girls right now their man ain't even ain't got a job jobless out here crying over some whatless man and you're still there and he still has the audacity the temerity to cheat girl you better wake up and smell it you better wake up and find that strength within you to bounce out because you're looking very silly you're looking very silly especially when you got the rest of the world knowing i think that's a, is that not does that not feel shambolic to me that's like hell 
I'm nowhere near trying to be out here like pretending, trying to be like, oh, let me put on a facade. Let me put on. Like, do you know how long that is? Do you know how, do you know how draining that is? The energy. I don't have the energy to perform any performing arts for any stupid boy. I'll promise you that. Don't say because you have children. There's people out here, there's single mom who is doing mom and dad. And we are very, 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 very okay. Oh, this is beautiful. It's beautiful. Ouch. The melt is really meltalini. So, I'm not, oh my God, I'm so... Ah! <laughs> I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna take some time allow yourself to detach like don't go and call him don't go and text him like just focus on you and focus on what you deserve don't look on social media and feel like you need to keep up an appearance everybody has their own rubbish they are dealing with in their house anybody that comes on social media to act like their lives are perfect their lives are probably the worst off even worse than yours find that Find that, find that point where that you can actually just be like, you know what, I am not going to accept this. It takes a while. It takes a while because you got to understand that you're no, if, if you're sure you're going to leave, you have to be in your mind, like in your mind, you have to be like, I know I'm not going back. I know I deserve more than this. And if I know I'm not going back, I have to cut all ties. And I've seen women, it's like they're not strong enough. So they will like talk to them for a while. Ah, let me talk to him to see how he's feeling. Let me pretend that I'm going back to go and pick up my shoe box. Hey, just leave. <laughs> Anyone who has the audacity to cheat on you is not worth your time. It's not worth your time. Like, and don't give them, you see what? I live off the satisfaction that, you know, I, I leave with grace. I don't need to have any sort of communication with you to speak to you about anything that happened. Like, you can't tell me that it accidentally, you accidentally brought out your willy and cheated. You accidentally went to her house and you mistakenly missed your step and end up in her bedroom. You can't mistakenly tell me that she seduced you. My man was seduced by another female. You're not my man. Me, I don't care whether you put Michael B. Jordan, maybe. Maybe I might have the accident. I might have a stumbling. Stumbling. <laughs> I might. I might stumble. <laughs> Michael be Jordan? Yeah. No jokes aside. I just there's nothing that someone could do that would make me cheat on my man. Like I don't know what is going on unless I know in my heart of heart that I'm ready to leave. I'm all for like whatever you do in your relationship is whatever you do in your relationship. So if say for example you guys have an a mutual you guys have a mutual agreement. But I'm gonna cheat on you and you I'm, you're gonna cheat on Oh lovely! We all have a mutual agreement to do our rubbish. Okay, it doesn't make sense here when one person is completely oblivious to, for, to your rubbish that you're doing outside. My lifelong dream is to wake up one day and see that all the women that have been cheated on ha are literally like awake and be like, I am no longer gonna be with this man anymore. And it's like all the women are on strike anymore, they're all on holiday and they're not coming back, they will start thinking about it. Maybe when women become more strong and, and use their brain and think, you know what, I'm worth more than this, then life will be good. And I still don't take that excuse about when you have a child, oh, you should stay there. That's you, B. That's definitely you, because it's definitely not me. What? God forbid, because I have a ch child. I don't care whether I've got six couplets. There are women out there who have children and are single parents and are doing more and doing better because their household is a lot more calm, is peaceful, you know, there's an amazing structure that she has, she's working, it's hard, don't get me wrong, it's not the easiest of things, but especially when you've got like one support, like I've got a couple of people to support me, boy, so it's not my own i can still you can still sit down i'm sitting down here i'm still doing cutie it's not that difficult it's just because you choose to sit there and if you choose to sit there now your own cup of tea be that missing out on anything neither is my son nobody's missing out on anything we are all very okay do you understand so you know if you are willing to listen to me mm? listen to your baby girl your baby girl will show you the way look at these curls though bye 
Asteria hair, you didn't have to come like that. <laughs> Asteria hair, you didn't have to step on my enemy with this chocolate brown. This chocolate brown is so cute with a little bit of like curls in it. For this year, yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you. I've been feeling like that Love Island has been very shit. It's not been gingering me as all the last years. Like before, I would literally run. Once it's nine o'clock, I've run to go and watch Love Island. But unfortunately, this year, it's not really been grabbing me as much. Like, let's say I'm not running, I'm walking. And let's say I don't mind 30 minutes going by to start from the beginning. So I'm not really, it's not gingering me as I did until, okay, so first of all, okay, let me think of my, what is my, who's my favorite? My favorite happens to be the one that just arrived. If I'm gonna be completely honest, like she's giving, she came in with that power, with that elegance, with that, you know, her smile is just smiling for days. Like she's just cute. And for me, I feel like I like a bit of, I like a little bit of um, eye candy when I'm watching TV. If I'm gonna be so hooked on something, I need to have like proper, proper eye candy. I love India. India's a vibe, but I feel like she's quite quiet. Um, nothing's really going on there But I don't know whether it's just because she's bored Like she's completely bored of Ikena And that shit made me laugh Because it's like How can How can Dami Come and grab this girl up In one second Yo when he picked her up I said Lord Jesus Hail Mary mother of God That is the Europe You see that Is what a true true I don't know whether he's Because I know people be stealing our Yoruba names these days I don't know if he's Yoruba But he's def he's obviously Nigerian but when he picked her up here, I said, that is the spirit, that is the spirit of a Nigerian boy. That right there is a spirit because it's not even the fact that he carried her, but it's the way he carried her. <laughs> it's the way, it's the way he carried her. I've seen it before. <laughs> I've seen it before. Those ones that they will captivate you. But he seems like he's going to be loyal to India and I approve. I really, really like that. I feel like they definitely are better suited. Ekin Sue, uh, babes, like, I just think she's trying too much. And I'm actually really, really happy that, she, that what happened is happening. Because no matter what and no matter how you feel about someone, I don't think you should ever do anything behind anyone's back. That, you see... I've, I've felt it, I know what it feels like to have someone doing that, like running on the terrace. Like it was funny at the time, but if that's actually happening to you where you feel like, oh, I'm getting to know someone, we're on the same page and la 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 la. And then you find them doing that, crawling from the, from the balcony to go and lips a boy, the boy has no idea. I think that is the violation. <laughs> I'm gonna head to the uh, head back and right. <laughs> I think that's a violation. This is happening because it's like that boy is, uh, what's his name? Oh, I don't know his name. Tom, not Tom. Jack, no. Ah, Jesus. I love Paige. She's really sweet. She seems like a sweet, sweet girl. But like I said, they're all giving me like, you know, uh, all the other years we had like different um, characters, yeah, that they just banged. Like you had like Amber, you had like Kaz, you know, those were really like, they were amazing girls, but they also had like a thing about them. The highlight of the whole in, um, thing so far has been when um, Dami picked up India. I won't lie to you. That lift, it it took me back. <laughs> it took me back. I need to see more of that in the house. I want to see that. You know, ginger me a little bit. Give me some Nigerian swag. I need to see some Nigerian vibes up in there. Like 
we got we got we got some chocolate people up in there that their vibes is not really showing i need it to be showing Ikenna, i'm sorry you had to leave it was time for you to go it was time for you to go it was time for you to go i can't lie it was giving very boring your body your body is nice though i love that i love when black men tan because the tan is gorgeous to die i love seeing that transpire like as the days go on and seeing how the skin just starts to pop out also the tongue thing the it needed to rest you need to now you've gone home you need to rest that you know i know sometimes when we're nervous we do some odd things like <laughs> but that could also be just really slimy and cringe so let's just leave the tongue in our mouth it wasn't giving as for pocahontas lioness i can't wait to see what she brings to the house Janice, i like the way she answered the questions when she was oh is it not tom you already tell you're attracted to me okay tell me how well you haven't broken eye contact with me once so that tells me that you're attracted to me uh -huh. and it also tells me that you're not intimidated by me which i kind of like okay mm -hmm. i feel like you need to kiss someone to know if it's there though so. hint hint I like him as well but in different angle his head shape his nose shape is looking a bit curved but <laughs> as well guys yeah so because you know i am doing music very soon i will have some new music coming out and when i did that video of me singing a song on tiktok yeah it was just something really brief i actually put in the comment section if this gets to 40k likes I will put out a version singing that song. Now, someone tagged me yesterday night and lo and behold, the likes on that video has now reached 50K. So I have to fulfill my promise and I have to go and actually go and ask to see if I can do the song because you know people will be best sentimental, bro. You can't do it. You can't do it. You can't do it. So I have to go and ask permission to see whether they will allow me. And if they do, I will release it. Because I did promise that. And it's so crazy because I just said it on an off chance because I had just started TikTok. Likes would ever get that much in the first place. <laughs> you know to just inspire people to keep following it oh, i gotta do the song now so i'm gonna ask permission if i'm able if i'm allowed to put out a version because i love that song Okay, this is definitely giving okay thank you so much asteria hair this one is definitely definitely one that i'm going to really enjoy i love this wig so bomb like the hair is literally you can run your hands through it so lovely and it was a very very full wig which i also adore and yeah i feel like it just goes really well with my skin tone like it just looks really good it's kind of remind it kind of reminds me when i have like 
the ginger one in it's bomb i love it chocolate baby chocolate thank you so much and i'll see you